fun yeah. about him. He plays a lot of different characters. We've seen him play randoms like all the time, you know, against other people. Um, like the likes of Angelic, you know, these people just play a lot of characters. They know what to yeah. do. So I wouldn't use that stone against Chris well, if I was Teemo. Yeah, like with Chris Wright, it's he's not a f like a specific fighting game specialist. He's not a character specialist. He's an overall fighting game right. specialist. This man just has the fundamentals for whatever fighting game he picks up. And yeah, he uh, explores a lot of characters in whatever games he plays. So uh, yeah, he will be very strong against this stone. I assume Teemo is going to be saving it for someone else. We haven't seen anybody use their stone just yet. And it's always a funny question of, okay, what is the quote-unquote worst team you could possibly give somebody if you have Mind Stone? But I feel like a lot of the characters can really thrive, you know? Yeah. And so it's hard. It's hard to really have a definite worst team, especially when it comes to the stones as well. Got a thumbs up from both sides. Bun checks are over. Timo from Canada. Ontario, Canada. Chris G., Soul Cow by way of New York. <laughs> All right, hovering over that Monster Hunter. Yeah. He's going for it, which I'm really excited. Personally, I think Monster Hunter, she's such a different type of character. You know, the way you have to use her, you know, the way you have to kind of revolve the tag system around her. Yeah. So it's going to be interesting to see how Christy is going to be able to defend against the high pace, you know, the fast pace of Teemo's team. Yeah, it seems like at 99 seconds, Chris is going to start with the Morgan. Hopefully get that first tag so he can start the Monster Hunter games after. Are they going to challenge each other? Chris G keeping the space immediately sold um, fist into tag. Oh, it's been a while. We, we don't remember the name of that move anymore. <laughs> yeah. we, we, don't, we don't see it as much. <laughs> the Soul was, oh, he tried. Ooh. Got the first hit with the armor, but Timo has started with a two for one already. And this man's execution is pretty darn good, I must say. Magneto player in Marvel 3, HSD glitch user yeah. in Infinite, hasn't dropped the combo just yet. God damn, both characters still getting smacked. HSD glitch already being used from Teemo. Space Stone, Chris looking for any way to get out of the situation, but you are still in the corner, yeah. my friend. You get chipped stuck. out. You no advancing guard saves him from it. But no punish. Oh, but she still dies. She's still out of there. It's all up to Morgan now. And she does not have very many options. Level 3 did not connect. Chris has four bars if he wants to go into the Astral Vision. I don't know what shenanigans he's got with it in this game. Oh my goodness, you're going to be blocking for a long time. Ooh, oh, the flight yes. into the empty flight. Oh. Using that flight dash down light at that very, very low height of the screen, nearly impossible to block or see, especially when you are already blocking the supers. The control right now from Timo. How is he flying? He is barely <laughs> off the ground. Oh my god, that is so dirty. So good. Timo. So good. Definitely want to know of his greatest, um, you know, mix-up options once he gets hit down. Now the box already sends out the javelins, trying to cover, give him some space to set up the Dormammu three blues. He's got three. Rose Garden, but he's just going to be holding up. He was already doing it. Finally gets the block. Not long enough to get a mix-up, though. Monster Hunter back in. Ooh. Tags both of them, but he didn't think he got the hit. No, he got it this time. Exactly. No meters for Timo to tag right now. Not just yet, anyways. Uses it right away. Gets Nova in. And using his little dive pick to get out of dodge. There's the tag again. Still tagging, though. Some damage on each oh. other's characters. Back and forth. Oh, Timo picks up the conversion off the pillar from long distance. Like the pace this man plays at, it might be unmatched currently in Marvel's Capcom Infinite. Okay, chasing down the tech. There is the storm activation from Chris G. Bringing Morgan in now. This is a good start for Chris G. Connecting the super this time. Much needed. Yeah, Katsimo holding that up back with that second low. Big sweep. Oh, just wants the reversal super. Give me my space back. Dormammu, of course, going to be starting to set up the blues. Has the Rose Garden already out. Nice push block into the jump back from Chris. Ooh, the evasion right now from Chris. Nice. Finds his way in. Double overhead. Baxter Hunter is in. Can he finish this? He does have a lot of meter right now. But what he's going to decide to do... Yeah, like this, at least finishing off with the Demon Super so he can get the Demon Stance and the level 3 from Morgan as well. That should be 
a dead Dormammu. Definitely. Use all the meters there, but well worth it. Gonna eliminate Teemo's opportunities to lock him down. Yeah, absolutely. Dormammu dead and a demon stance. So it's a pretty ideal situation for Chris at this point. Ooh! Connor chasing him down right now. Some other javelin again. He's gonna be quicker with those dashes thanks to the demon stance, but he immediately brings in Morgan back after the arrows. And even though Timo has a long road right now, he's playing and moving as if he, he isn't. But nice catch from Christy. Yeah, I think that's a great point, though. Timo was not playing like a man who had a hill to climb, right? <laughs> he was just playing his usual game, which I think is good. It's a good sign that he's keeping his composure despite being in a losing situation. Chris, with the composure himself, able to seal out yeah. the second game. Tying it up one to one. And Chris, she's doing a great job of, you know, not giving in to the pressure of Timo right now. Adjusting the volume on those headphones. Got the thumbs up. Let's get into the game three. Of course, this is just our third match overall of the entire tournament. If you're just joining us here at Battle for the Stones Finals. The mom are already on his way to the three blues with two. Ooh, that could have been a throw opportunity. Yeah, you see this Ooh, and I love the way she swings that sword. Yeah. <laughs> Gets both again. He ties it right back into Monster Hunter. Beating him up. Got the demon stance going. Lots of damage. Oh, that space. Ooh, nice defense. Christy trying to chase down that tech. Couldn't get the confirm. Christy actually contested. Oh, oh that, that demon great. stance mix up off the soul fist. Oh, and the range on this sword, it does not even matter that he's in this box right now, but Timo finally picking up a hit, going immediately into... Oh, but the level 3 did not connect. Yeah, That's not. actually huge for Christy. Yeah, absolutely. Dodged a lot of damage with that one. Oh, brings him down with the nice. arrows. That brings them all the way down to the counter switch was forced out by Timo. That was a dead Dormammu otherwise. Yes. But you saw that Christy backed away. Went back to just using the range on Monster Hunter. Cool. And he was going to exhaust his tag option, and now he has no meters to tag, so he has to hold all of this. Chris has four meters on deck, too. Definitely spin that one. We'll see if he goes into level three with Morgan like he did last time. I think he will. Yes, he does. Spins all of it. Tons of damage, but is it going to be enough? I'm going to put Nova no, on life support. Isn't. I like that activation from Chris right there. All right, you live through the combo, but you don't get a tag out. <laughs> Space Storm. Exactly. Just goes for that cross. Oh, up. oh the cross under. <laughs> she got her own cross up with that demon stance. The sped up dash through. Oh. Looking good right now. 2 1 Chris G. Looking to send Timo into the loser's bracket. Yeah, of course, Chris G, the 2016 uh, Ultimate Wild versus Capcom 3. Mm -hmm champion how he earned his spot here in battle for the stones still has yet to run it with the ghost of marvel but we got a long <laughs> long way to go in this game's lifespan right on to the next match christy sticking with his game plan oh, keeping yeah. morgan on point but mostly just using her to set up some avenues but nice confirm two for one for chris it's looking real strong for the champ it's the counter switch. Nice defense from Timo. He definitely needed to block that. Huge confirm, too. Gonna even out some of the life. Get some setups. Oh, that wow. was definitely a mistake, but Christy picking it up. Yeah, I was ready as soon as the combo dropped to start going in. And yeah, I think Timo got his push blocks a little wonky right there. Ended up getting tagged. There's the activation from Demo, but he is in the corner right now. Oh, great. Empty dash low. Nice. Making sure he makes full use of that storm activation and taking out Morgan right now is pretty huge for Kush because that is going to limit Monster Hunter, but we did see him putting in work with her. Immediate confirm, immediate hit off of the javelin. Yeah, I like him keeping Nova in right now because if Dormammu does come in and Chris gets to activate that Space Storm, which he's going to, he'll be able to kill off Dormammu in a single combo. But it is tough. Once Dormammu gets started, it's tough to get in on, on the box because of the stock player. Yes, flare. the level three. Oh, no. He didn't use that. No, he did. He it, did. That's why it ended open. the Space Storm, yeah. so he tagged out. Good stuff from Timo being aware. Yeah, great. 
I definitely thought that it was going to hit both of them when it came out. Ooh, Tai! Oh, oh, no. Not out of it just yet, not and Chris is still in it! The flame carpet dissipates off the hit from Monster Hunter. Space Storm is available from Teemo, though. It's going to be real tough in this situation. There's the activation. Ladies and gentlemen, goes for the overhead. Finds the hit. He's going to get into Demon Stance. Needs to waste as much Space Storm as possible. The energy javelin is going to go for the chip. chip out. Definitely needed to get that chip in there because you do not want to give Chris G any avenues no. to make a comeback because he will do it. My man has been in high-level tournament environments way too often. Like, he will make that comeback for sure. And going down to the last match, 2-2. Two two, another very, very close set. Yep, two out of our three matches have gone down to the wire. Game five, get some of that H2O in you. Stay real fresh. Now I'm wondering if Timo should have used that stone right here in the last game, you know, switch up the plan. Yeah. Never know. However, not happening just yet. No, no stone activations just yet today. And just knocking him out of the air, but it does not stop Timo from <laughs> swinging anyways on wake up. I like the little side switch combo he has there. Getting that corner control and backing up. Getting that space, making sure he covers wow. any tech, but the defense. Yeah, that was ridiculous. I can't believe he actually got uh, pushed to the other side because of that low flight from Nova and chasing down Darmamu. Well, let's not forget Timo does have a stone. If Chris wins, I believe that's his, right? Ooh. Oh, yeah. You're Ooh. right. And Chris is looking good so far. Has a lot of meters on deck. Timo can't counter switch just yet. That's why he's going to activate into the super, prevent him from counter switching. Christy is looking really, really good right now. Doesn't have much to worry about as long as he's still enjoying him. Hey, he got to the other side. That was fast. Just going to try to do a regular super, drain some time, create some space. But Nova's in with the Thorns and the box. You are not going anywhere. He's going to activate a level 3, get as much damage as possible on Chris's Morgan. Meter is very even for both sides here. He's going to use the super. Oh, but Dormammu was already in. He's got to be careful. Try to bring him back close, but we got the reversal super from Chris. Takes down both of them, and he gets the OTG, but funky combo. Can't complete it. Swinging for the fences, yep. gets the cross-up. That cross-up has been working out extremely well for Chris G. Has definitely opened up Teemo a handful of times in this set alone with it. Let's see the incoming now. A little early on the setup. Nova came out a little bit late. But she is swinging right now. He needs to be careful about how he approaches. But Chris is not afraid right now. And getting all that damage. Chris G. Still just needs a pixel left. Chuck them arrows. Yep. Timo got a long way to go. Ooh. Ooh. Deep push block. Sending Nova all the way to the other side. This is dangerous for Timo right now. Gonna just swing on him. It. Just manages to avoid that last piece <laughs> of chip. All right, Timo definitely slowing it down now. Trying to find his way in here and there. Still managing to stay alive. No meters on Chris G's side. So Timo might have an opportunity here. Ooh. Gets the slide, which is not a low. So he caught Chris G either trying to move, dash, jump. Caught him. That's the point. And he has so much meter. Going for level one. Oh, he can't but finish he's still alive. it. He's going to go with the super. Oh, oh, he caught her. No tag. From that is going to take away the power of specials of Timo's Nova, though. Oh. Tries for the touchdown overhead. Oh, yeah, yeah he's just going to go for the chip. Oh, oh the super. Oh. It does not. Chris G takes it 3 2. I believe we have oh. a new bearer of the Mind Stone. Yes, we do. Because if you lose, the winner will take your stone. Oh, yeah. So, man, that's... <laughs>